Hey, what's going on, y'all? Y'all know it is. It's Nas the Goddess. One of the first things I wanted to show you guys, um, honey. Um, when you get your honey, pay attention to, you know, where it's made and stuff like that. Honey is the best natural sweetener that you can use. If you still got that white sugar up in your cabinet, I'm going to pop you because you don't need to have that stuff in your cabinet. Like, that's like crack. Like, sugar is literally one molecule away from being crack cocaine. Like, seriously, it's a drug. Take it out of your house. Stop giving that shit to your kids. So, anyway, this is raw Manuka honey. In particular, this is Manuka honey. It's a little bit pricey, but it's really, really worth it. Um, it's the best honey you can possibly use. And to any of my singers, artists, rappers out there, whatever, this is extremely good for taking care of the throat. It's very anti it's, um an antibacterial, it keeps a lot of bacteria, germs away, off of the vocal cords, very soothing to the vocal cords, and co coats the vocal cords, and makes them really strong. So, Manuka honey, really good. Um, let me show you some other things. Okay, fall is coming up, so this is something that's really, really good for you. This is liquid chlorophyll. So for those of you who don't like to eat your salads and you don't like to eat your greens, this is really good for you to get, especially, especially coming up on the fall and winter. Because in the fall and winter, you get way, way less sunlight outside. So you need to drink and eat the sun. Do you hear what I'm saying? You need to eat and drink the sun because you're gonna get less sun on your skin when the fall and winter comes in. And so if you don't like to eat your greens, get some liquid chlorophyll because this is basically liquid plants okay so when you know you grind up a plant or you juice that green stuff that comes out of the plant is basically the blood of the plant chlorophyll this is like drinking sunlight so when the fall and winter is coming in get some of this okay and it's not very much this is a bigger one but um dang i don't see any small ones but they also usually have one that's a little bit smaller than this that's like not even six dollars i think it's like 5.69 or something and this one is i don't know like 7.99 or something and you know don't act like that's expensive because some of y'all spent more than that on that blunt that y'all bought the other day so don't play with me get your stuff and be healthy so this is liquid chlorophyll all right i'll put it in the links below so that you can know how to spell it but this is liquid chlorophyll and it's really good for you all right um, this is liquid chlorophyll, <laughs> and basically what it is, it's the blood of the plant, and so it's really good like in the fall, when fall and winter are about to come up, because like in the summertime, which is why you don't see people get as sick in the summertime, because there's more sunlight, and the sun kills off a lot of the bacteria and germs that will get on the skin. But when the fall and winter is coming up, we're getting less sun on our skin. So you want to take in more sun. And that's what plants are. Plants are just sunlight. <laughs> you know what I mean? So liquid chlorophyll is chlorophyll. And this one I think has mint in it. Um, but like you can get it online too. Or you can get it in here. And all you do is you can put like a couple of capfuls in your water. Or like you take your water with you work or different things like that. Yeah. Put a couple of cat pills in your water. It's really, really potent. And just be careful with it too when you use it because it'll stain. It's oh, like okay. really, really potent so it can stain your counters and your clothes and stuff. But yeah, it's really good for oh, you and okay. it puts a lot of iron in your blood. Oh, a lot of iron. Yeah. So it's Thanks really good for you. You're welcome. Okay, guys. Um, let's go over here. Okay, over here too is a lot of the like juices and energy drinks and stuff like that which is cool when you i guess really you know need that or whatever and you can't get it any other way but i'm not really into a lot of the energy drinks and things like that i'm a believer in just getting it through your food and your normal water and your normal herbal teas and things of that nature i'm not really with all the energy boost not even from the health food store because your body makes plenty of energy and is its own internal pharmacy as long as you're putting the right things in it so come on let's go okay another really great thing for you coconut water okay coconut water is one of the most alkaline waters that you can possibly drink 
it's super super good for any and everybody coconut water very very alkaline and what do I mean when I say alkaline okay when I'm talking about alkalinity that means the level of purity that it has you have acid and you have alkalinity okay when you're eating and drinking things that we know are not generally healthy those things are acidic and when something is acidic what it's doing it's it's breaking down the cellular walls turning it into mush mucus basically in the body and that's what causes disease in the Western world they have names for a million different diseases but at the end of the day all disease is disease non-ease of the body is a buildup and an excess of mucus in the body that's all it is disease is just mucus in the body so in order to keep the mucus out or at a very low minimum you want to take in drink and eat things that are highly alkaline alkalinity keeps down the acid the acid down in the body keeps the cellular wall strong and operating and functioning and keeps you fun and dope shit like that so come on um, I'm trying to show y'all a few things point out real quickly cuz I'm really here to get my food but I'm trying to show y'all some highlights real quick. Um, what okay we're over here with some oils okay? your oils are very important why not only for the skin but also for the body okay First thing I wanted to show you is um, sesame oil. Sesame oil is also a really strong antibacterial. No bacteria, no germs can grow in sesame oil. So sesame oil is really great to put on your body every day, especially before you take a shower or a bath rub it into the body, massage it into the body kind of vigorously. And also what sesame oil does is that it stimulates growth hormones. Growth hormones are those hormones that keep you looking young, keep your skin supple, keep you vibrant. So sesame oil, all of that, just in a bottle of oil, yes, you can create new growth hormones, which is what you know they're trying to do in labs and you know in hospitals when someone's sick or has a disease that's what they're doing with the stem cells and all that they're trying to recreate growth hormones and sesame oil actually stimulates growth hormones to be produced in the body when it's massaged into the body so when you massage this into your body particular three hot spots to do is right here in the middle of the eyebrows we call that the third eye which brings a lot of peace and calm and clarity mental state also right here in between the breastbone right here on the breastbone which is what we call our heart chakra and just rubbing this area a little bit over that area it stimulates patience and it also reduces anger and irritation in the person and then also if you rub a little bit of this over the stomach area that helps to regulate digestion as well as to stimulate the metabolism and the immune system so this is sesame oil and I know I'm going a little quickly so if anybody has any questions all you gotta do is inbox me or hit me up in the comments or whatever I'll be more than happy to answer your question so um, this is sesame oil really really good for you get that sesame oil um, another oil that's really good for you um, of course olive oil always really good now I do recommend if you get olive oil that you try to get it in something that does have a darker jar well that was not that dark but it's darker than this one because really um, ideally olive oil should be kept in something dark it really doesn't need to get a lot of sunlight in order to keep it at its optimum so but anyway olive oil always a great usage hair skin food everything and also a side note when it comes to using things on your skin I know ladies but also gentlemen um, be aware when you use something on your skin or put it in your hair if you can't eat it then you shouldn't be putting it in your hair or on your skin if you can't eat it don't put it on your skin because your skin is taking it in and it's going into the bloodstream too so when you're getting your lotions and oils and whatnot look on it and see what's in it because I mean really it just gets no purer than sesame oil olive oil the coconut oil your grapeseed oils because you can eat all of these oils so they're perfectly good to put on your skin but some people's skin act, react differently to different type of oils so you just have to test out and see what works for you um, also walnut oil very strong antibacterial as well so walnut oil really good also a really good one to use during the fall and winter season so that's that 
and in case you don't know what it looks like any of you here's your coconut oil it can come solid like this or you can also get it at, um, already in liquid form as well so that's your coconut oil your olive oils your your oils so that's what that is and then let's run over here real quick to the dates <laughs> Okay, right here. Okay. These are medjool dates right here. These are really, really good. These are also a good sweetener. Like if you want to sweeten your smoothies or you're making some type of dessert that calls for sugar, you can use dates as a replacement. They're very, very sweet, but they're a natural sugar. Really good for you, really good for the skin, good for the nails, and perfect 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 sweetener if it calls a recipe a dessert calls for sugar you can replace it with dates you just blend them up with a little bit of water in the blender until it's kind of syrupy and that's your sugar that's your sweetener um what else was i going to say about dates <clears throat> oh they're a good snack you know mix them with some nuts or you can just eat them by yourself i like to just eat them like by themselves like with my salads or whatever so dates are really good for you So those are dates and they're a great sweetener and oh I want to show you guys some black one. These are my two favorite waters right here. Um, black water and essential water. Black water is highly highly alkaline highly highly alkaline and black water is really super excellent for both men and women and women it's really good for the womb the uterus and in men it's really good for the prostrate black water drink this and also this one right here this one has a really high alkalinity as well highest alkalinity you can get is like 10 this one is like 9.5 so but also what I will tell you too the only thing that I would like to see with these two brands of water that could be better is if they were in glass because ideally you want your water to be in glass, not plastic. So, you know, that's just a little side note. Carry your water in glass if you can. Me, what I do sometimes is I transfer these over to like a glass container or whatever. So, black water, good for the reproductive and the prostrate, all of that. This, a lot of alkalinity, keep the acid down in the body and clean the blood at the same time. So, um, one quick other thing, let's go over to the spices. They moved a lot of stuff around. Let me see. Um, okay, okay, I don't know where they moved the spices. They moved a lot of stuff around this door. I think they might be over there. Okay, anyway, I was gonna tell you, coming up now on fall and winter, what you want to put more of in your food is spice. Put a lot more cayenne in your food. Even if you feel like, oh, I don't like spicy stuff. No, your body likes spicy stuff. Your immune system likes spicy and your blood likes spicy. Spicy is really good because it makes the blood strong and it purifies the body. So a lot more spicy. So that was everything I'm gonna show y'all right now because I gotta do my shopping and get my food for real, for real. So anyway, I just wanted to give y'all a quick little rundown. Don't be intimidated by the health food stores. Come in here, get your stuff, keep it healthy. Be healthy, y'all, because the shit is dope. All right, it's the goddess. I love you.